India's fastest hurdler, Jyoti Yaraji ended third in the women's 100 hurdles event, but was upgraded to a silver medal at the Hangzhou Asian Games on Sunday after a controversial false start, which led to uncertainty about her getting disqualified. The silver medal was finally awarded to Yaraji, but not before she had to make an impassioned case for herself, and the race was restarted under the cloud of uncertainty. What had led to the drama was that the race saw a false start by home favourite Yanni Wu and India's Yaraji appeared to be reacting to the Chinese hurdler's cue. Whistles initially told both runners that had been disqualified for false start. This led to an audible groan in the stadium, since Wu is one of the host country's biggest stars in athletics. Yarahi and Wu both stood their ground and protested with the officials who looked at the TV monitors alongside the track to see what had happened. Replays clearly showed that Wu was the first one to react and that Yaraji had reacted to her cue. Both athletes were allowed to race, but there was some confusion whether they would be allowed to retain their medals in the case of them winning. Yaraji crossed the finish line behind China's Yu Lin and Wu. Later, Yaraji was upgraded to silver. After the women's 100-meter hurdles final, Yanni said that she had regrets in this game and hoped to make up for it in future training and competitions. Looking forward to the Paris Olympics, she said she hopes she can show China's speed, Chinese magnanimity, Chinese demeanor and Chinese strength at the Olympics. I hope that I will get better and better, and I also believe that China's track and field will get better and better. Wu Yanni responded to the false start after the game. She was unable to hold on due to the influence of the opponent next to her. I couldn't hold on due to the influence of the opponent next to me. I really regret that I came in second place today. I hope to find efficiencies in future training and competitions and show China's strength at the Paris Olympics.